Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe and put likes, because your support is important for us. And here we go. German Vice Chancellor Robert Habeck's recent visit to Kiev has underscored the burgeoning strategic partnership between Germany and Ukraine, particularly in the realm of defense. Accompanied by prominent German industrialists, including Helmut Rauch, CEO of Deal Defense, the visit marked a significant milestone in bolstering Ukraine's defense capabilities amidst escalating tensions in the region. A focal point of the discussions was the rapid delivery of advanced anti-air systems to Ukraine by Deal Defense, notably the Iris-T SLM system. Helmut Rauch's announcement, as reported by the German Daily Bild, highlighted the commitment to expedite the deployment of these cutting-edge defense systems to enhance Ukraine's aerial defense capabilities. Rauch's assurance of swift deliveries resonated with earlier sentiments expressed by Ukrainian Air Force spokesperson Yuri Anat, who lauded the performance of the Iris-T system, citing its purported 100% effectiveness in countering aerial threats. Such commendation underscores the potential of the Iris-T system to mitigate the escalating risk posed by Russian incursions utilizing drones and cruise missiles. The Iris-T, renowned for its efficacy in intercepting aerial targets, represents a cornerstone of modern air defense systems. Developed by Deal Defense, this short to medium range missile system boasts advanced features tailored for precise engagement of aircraft, helicopters, and short range missiles. Its exceptional maneuverability, coupled with a sophisticated infrared seeker, ensures high accuracy even in the face of electronic countermeasures. Moreover, emphasis was placed on the post war reconstruction efforts during Habeck's visit, underscoring Germany's commitment to supporting Ukraine's recovery and rebuilding process. The forthcoming conference on reconstruction in Berlin signifies a collaborative approach towards addressing the aftermath of conflict and fostering sustainable development in Ukraine. In parallel, German demoning experts from Global Clearance Solutions GCS, are actively engaged in clearing the lethal remnants of war in Ukraine, mitigating the threat posed by landmines and improvised explosive devices IEDs. GCS's deployment of demoning systems underscores the importance of international cooperation in addressing humanitarian crises and ensuring the safety of civilian populations. Looking ahead, Vice Chancellor Habeck's itinerary includes a visit to Moldova, where tensions between Russian influence and European alignment continue to escalate. This diplomatic engagement underscores Germany's proactive stance in promoting stability and security across the region, reaffirming its commitment to upholding European values and principles. In conclusion, Vice Chancellor Habeck's visit to Kiev symbolizes the deepening partnership between Germany and Ukraine in the realm of defense and security. Through strategic collaboration and tangible support, both nations are poised to navigate the challenges posed by regional instability and chart a path towards peace, prosperity, and resilience. That's all for now. See you later.